Good evening. I am coming from Southern Baptist Theological Seminary after just now completing my classes for uh, missiology here on campus. I will continue on online and uh, so with my systematic theology course. I wanted to uh, just come and share what God has really shown and revealed myself and what I'm excited about in the ministry which God has called me. And that is exactly what I wanted to share here tonight which is that undoubtedly, without question, the Lord has called me and to become a pastor and to also teach uh, theology and to help grow up the next generation in the defense and the growth and the preservation of our Lord and Savior and His mighty church. Uh, we are here to share the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. And uh, I want to, with all my heart with all my being share that and do the works in which he has called me to do i'm excited to return home tomorrow at sunday and worship with my church which i will be able to do in the morning uh, and i'm excited for that and to serve in my church with all my heart with all my being with every bit of power uh, which the lord by his grace his everlasting grace is uh, allows me to do um, I hope to become a deacon. I hope to uh, be a helpmate in, in every which way for my church and service in terms of assistance in the teaching of the Sunday schools and whatever else the Lord continues to allow me to do in assisting our wonderful pastor. Um, and finally, I just want to thank you all for the support and financially for the sport spiritually mm -hmm. first and foremost and then financially um, also and uh, just the, uh, the all the uh, all the good tidings and, and, and friendship that we have had and um, continue to have uh, ultimately no matter what happens in life God gets the glory and that's what matters most so I cannot wait to share with you all and to continue to do the blogs again, but also uh, grow the ministry uh, here on All Things Veritas and elsewhere as we continue to grow and do things. So I want to finish with a word and a prayer, and we will close this for the night as I prepare to leave tomorrow morning. i got to get up at 3 a.m., uh, get to the airport by 4, get my car in, which I rented, and I will be flying around out about 6 o'clock and I will make it to home by 1018. So now let me read a word and a prayer and we will close for here. Uh, Psalms 1, always a good way to end out here. It says, Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the wicked, nor stands in the way of sinners, nor sits in the seat of scoffers. But his delight is in the law of the Lord. On his law he meditates day and night. He is like a tree planted by the streams of water that yields its fruit in its season, and its leaf does not wither. In all he does, he prospers. The wicked are not so, but are like shaft that the wind drives away. Therefore the wicked will not stand in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For the Lord knows the way of the righteous, but the way of the wicked will perish. Holy Father, God our Lord, Jesus Christ, I pray for all that we do and all that we say, and all that we live, that it glorifies you, and that we walk not in the way of the wicked, but in the way of the righteous, and uphold you, and glorify you throughout the earth. In your name we pray, Jesus Christ our Savior, amen. I thank you all, friends. I'm excited about what God is doing in the ministry, and pushing me, and encouraging me, and I know, without a shadow of a doubt, that the Lord is leading this and carrying me and my family through. Thank you so much. God bless. And see you all at my church tomorrow. Um, and I will be back on here uh, this next week. And we'll be continuing the vlogging, sharing about seminary, how I got here, everything that's coming up. Thank you. God bless.